everyone welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna to be doing the swatch video for the glitters that I got from glitter sparkle nail design I am so excited to show you all these colors because they are amazing um, what I'm doing is just putting them in some builder gel um, on some swatch stick so I'm putting the gel along with the glitter in the back of the swatch stick and then I'll show you me top coating them so you can see um, how they look all shiny um, and I'll go through them one by one so we'll just get straight into it the first glitter is called flower power and this is a purple one but there's loads of different colored dots in there along with the purple glitter and the flowers when I show you the swatch you'll see all the different colors in it but I love this glitter I'm definitely a purple girl and I love my purples so I love this one so I've just buffed the surface of the swatch stick so that you can really see the difference when I top coat it because if you just put it underneath and you don't put any top coat on it it can look a bit dull and I really wanted to, to show these glitters off because they really deserve it, they're amazing. Vicky who runs this company along with her husband, she gives you so much product for your money and she's such a lovely person. So yeah, definitely go and check her out. I'll put her link to her channel in the description box as well as the um, Facebook shop that she's got where she sells these glitters. So here it is, glitter top coated. And you can see all the different coloured dots in there. You can see that metallic flower that's in there. There's lots of different coloured flowers, I think. This is just a gold one that I happened to pick up. But how gorgeous is that? It's so beautiful, it really is. Now, how big are these bags? These are 10 gram bags for £2. So you get a lot of product for your money. These are amazing. Okay, so moving on now. This is another favourite of mine. This is called Be Mine. And this is like a pink iridescent glitter. I think it's got um, bits of red in it. It's even got little um, shimmery hearts in it. It's got lots of different things in, but looking at it in the bag, you just can't see how gorgeous it is. I originally saw this one when Gigi from MVP Nail Design, she did um, a video with these glitters where she was showing them. Um, and when she showed this one, I loved it then. And I'm so glad I've got this one. So there is an iridescent heart in there somewhere, and there's lots of different shapes in there that are iridescent that change as you as you turn it. It's got loads of dimension. This one, it is absolutely gorgeous. Obviously, I've just been using these with clear gel, um, no sort of colour background or anything like that. But if you put this one over a pink, it will probably look even more gorgeous. So I'm not going to do that today. I'm just going to show you over clear to see you exactly what the glitter looks like just on its own with nothing else I'm really sorry if you can hear my washing machine in the background it's just started it's spin so it's really loud I'm sorry about that okay so I'm just going to show you it next to the bag um, because you just can't see from the bag how gorgeous it is it just looks a bit pink and you can't see exactly what's in it but when you see it there next to it on the swatch stick and all the iridescent I think it's mylar that's in there and um, it shifts from um, like green to pink it is beautiful absolutely beautiful I really love this one okay so this one um, was actually made for princess nails by Diana so that's why it's called princess diva um, and she loves her purples as well just like me um, and I said on the unboxing video that it looks like Vicky's just bunged everything into one glitter and I love that I really love it that there's so many different colors in this one this one, um, it's quite fine, a glitter, and it was really, really hard to take photographs of this and film it because this is the one that just wouldn't focus. And from that bag, it does look colourful, but when you put it on the swatch stick, you can see there's bits of green in it and things that I couldn't see before when I was just looking in the bag. But there are some bigger pieces in there, and there's a green one on this swatch stick that you'll see in a minute. It's just gorgeous, this one. I mean, it looks amazing on its own, but if you were to put, you know, a purple base under that, it would really make it pop. So I am going to be doing a collaboration video with these um, glitters. So I can't wait to do that as well. But the problem for me is I don't know which ones I'm going to choose because I can't, I don't think I can use all of them in it. I wish I could. But yeah, it's going to be a very hard choice because they are all amazing. So here it is close up when it's been top coated you can see that green hex in there and you can see all the different colours in there. It really is beautiful. 
so you can see there's also bigger uh, pink I think the circles the pink ones so there's pink ones in there and there's blue there's more green it's just everything there's lots of little bits of tinsel as well it's just like a glitter explosion every glitter is a surprise when you get into it right so this one I thought was going to be my favorite one this is ice blast and it is gorgeous it looks completely blue there but when you see it swatched you'll see that it's not just blue it's even better so I'd say this one was an iridescent one as well I don't know whether this is mylar or not but it's not difficult to use like mylar where the mylar sticks up everywhere and that this uh, this isn't like that it's really easy to work with so as that top coat's going on you can see that there isn't just blue in there there's like green as well and um, when I lift it up and I show you there's also other colors in there there's pinks as well it is just so so gorgeous I am definitely wearing this one I just really want to know what it's going to look like over sort of a baby blue as well because that's probably what I'm going to be using it with and I'll try it over white as well I think so I'll just turn it and then you can see look you can see all the pink the green the blue there's even like sort of goldy yellow in there as well so I think all the color shifting ones while they all look blue in the bag it's not just blue how gorgeous is that I love it okay so moving on this next one is called Alice in Wonderland um, this one I only saw um, photos of it because this isn't one that so I've seen someone else with so I didn't know what this one was going to be like until I received it um, and so it was really nice um, and I saw all the stars in it and everything and I thought it was a really nice colour um, but then when I actually used it as, as with all these glitters there was a surprise and that is how many different coloured stars are in it and the dimensions of all the colours it's just it's another gorgeous one they're just all really special these glitters they're, they're just not you know your bog standard let's just do this colour glitter there's all sorts in every one they are all so unique so a lot of these glitters when you see them um, you don't really need a base colour underneath because they're so full of colour. I mean you could just put you know like a really small amount on to cover something um, using a base colour but if you wanted to just use them on their own you can just use them on their own because I mean this Alice in Wonderland one it's so packed full of stuff you don't need anything underneath that. It's just gorgeous just as it is. So here it is next to the bag, look at that, I mean you would not imagine that all those different things were in that bag, because you just can't see them in the bag. Okay so this next one is called Pixie, and this is, um, it's blue, it looks purple there when I'm showing you in the bag, but um, it's got purple and it's got pink and it's got blue in it. And they're mainly all the same size, these little dots. I don't think there's anything bigger in this one. I think it's mainly just these little dots, but they are absolutely gorgeous. And the shine on this one, because all this glitter is holographic. Well, I think it's holographic anyway. This would definitely go really well over some base colours. You could put it on really thin. But like with them all, they're so packed full. Of different colors that you don't really need anything underneath them I think with this one I like it because the colors go so well together they really do set each other off
okay so now we're moving on to this one this is called blue bling and I wasn't sure about this one I got this one and I thought I'm really not sure about the color I don't know I don't know how sort of bright that's gonna be because if you're only seeing it in a bag it's it's really hard to tell but I am so glad that I got this one um, because you'll see when I put it on the swatch stick it's just oh, all the colors in it all the different shapes in it it really is what it's called blue bling that's what it is there's so many um, hexes and, and circles and different shapes that are like holographic and I think there's are there stars in it I'm not sure if there's stars in it but there's, there's so much in it yeah there's hexes in it there's different colored circles you've got green ones and pink and gold and just about every color you can imagine so this is obviously more of a chunky one but there is a lot of fine glitter in there they're all like that to be honest they've all got um, apart from the ice blast one they've all got fine glitter in as well as the chunky glitter so the fine glitter kind of fills in the gaps and it's just gorgeous this one it really is it was such a surprise when I put it on with the gel to see what was actually in it so that one definitely gets my vote I love it I love them all I really do so please watch to the end because I've got a video at the end showing all the colors together and it really is amazing to see them all next to each other and it took a long time for me to be able to get um, you know I get it on film how they really looked because glitter does not like to be photographed it does not like to be filmed it's really difficult to actually show the colors and the glitters in the true light so let me know in the comments which is your favorite one and if you would use them um, if you would wear them and what you know what you think of them are they good quality I think they're amazing quality and for the price I mean that's 10 grams that bag is huge I normally pay the same price about two pounds for three grams of glitter from other companies you just don't get this much so this is the last one this was a free gift um, given to me by Vicky because um, I sent something to her so she sent me this um, this glitter so I didn't pick this one so it's got all that gold in it but it's not um, it's not gold gold I think I'm right in saying it's more like champagne gold but then it's mixed with there's like orange hexes in there there's there's pink like the bright pink in it there's silver in it there's smaller orange hexes in it I'm just trying to see how many different things there are in there it's really surprising because when you look at the bag it just looks like it's gold with a few flecks of pink in it and it's not it's just so much more than that this one is going to be amazing for Christmas and autumn and Halloween there's so many things you could use this for so that was the last glitter please tell me in the comments what is your favorite which one would you wear or would you wear all of them do you love them as much as I do are you looking forward to the collaboration because that will be up I will be filming that um, when will I be filming that next week sometime I think so here they are all together just on the swatch sticks I will try and zoom in there's a little clip just after this one that shows you really really zoomed in so you can see all the dimension and everything like that in the color so there's flower power be mine ice blast princess diva Alice in Wonderland pixie blue bling and the last one is boss chick so that is all of the eight that I've got to show you I really hope you like this video as much as I like doing it so yeah tell me in the comments what you think please like and subscribe subscribe to Vicky as well um, and I will see you in the next video thank you so much for watching and thank you for subscribing if you're not already subscribed please consider subscribing I do try and upload at least twice a week I do reviews and de nail designs and swatches and things like that so come back and check out another video see you next time